Hey guys, it's Timmy, and this is Brussling Unlimited. So recently, well, actually not even recently, we got to go back and back and back and back to earlier this year. Allegations came out on Vince McMahon as far as misconduct and sexual stuff and this and that, that eventually led to Vince McMahon stepping away, but also kind of being forced out of the company. Then recently, there were new reports stating that Vince was telling people he's coming back. He wants back in the company. And now it sounds like Vince has found out a way to plot his return to WWE per a new report from the Wall Street Journal as they state that McMahon, who has majority voting power through his ownership of WWE's Class B stock, has told the company that he's electing himself and two former co-presidents and directors, Michelle Wilson and George Barrios, to WWE's board. He will then also seek to become executive chairman based off of that. Now, we've heard all the rumors and news and reports and stuff that Vince has the right to do this as far as his voting power does go. That Vince can do this and almost nobody can stop him. That he can place key members on the board that can then vote him back into power, regardless if anybody in the company right now wants him in power or not. So it looks like Vince McMahon is plotting his return to the company, which at the same time could be plotting the demise of WWE. As far as why I call this the demise, there's a line in this report that states, quote, he has communicated to the board that unless he has direct involvement as executive chairman from the outset of a strategic review, he won't support or approve any media rights deal or sale, the people said. Again, Vince McMahon has the power to do this based off of holding the majority of WWE's Class B stock. There was the potential rumors of a, I guess you could say, sale talk which after hours shot up the WWE stock today. So if there is talks of a sale again, Vince can say no. Do you hear anything else on Vince? I guess you could say based off this new report from the Wall Street Journal, planning to put himself, Michelle Wilson, and George Barrios on the board of directors to vote himself back in as CEO and chairman. We'll have it for you right here on Pro Wrestling Unlimited. But that's going to do it for this episode. Remember to comment below. Like and share this video, like us on Facebook, Instagram, and Twitter, and subscribe right here on YouTube.